Greece and Greece is another person's fast for tourist Amazing! Gracious! Another person's fast for choice, Lori! Yay! Yay! Amazing! Gracious! Another person's fast for choice, Lori! Yay! Yay! Hello, what's up guys? My name is Percy and I'm the Guinness World Record holder for the largest collection of fast food toys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so uh, how you doing guys? I hope you're doing great because I'm here once again <laughs> to tell you another amazing and stupendous and all inspiring versus fast food toy story and boy have I got a toy for you. <laughs> Okay, so our toy for today is none other than dun, ta -da -dun, ta -da -da -dun. Okay, so the toy is Belt from the movie The Croods uh, from DreamWorks. Okay, so The Croods was actually uh, produced by DreamWorks and this particular toy was brought to us by McDonald's Happy Meal way back in 2013. That was the time when The Croods movie was actually released. Of course, I mean it would make sense if McDonald's would release certain movie characters or movie toys, uh, movie related toys, uh, yeah, which are not in sync, in sync or not synchronized with the actual release. Also. Okay, uh, well, McDonald's is smarter than that. Okay, so most likely the movie Crudes was also released in 2013. Okay, now let's open this up. It was seven years ago since I've had this and this is the only time that we get to unravel or unwrap this particular uh, fast food toy. And aren't we lucky? Okay, so together, let's see. Let's unravel this amazing toy. So it's called Belt. Okay, Belt. And Belt uh, sort of looks like a slot. Okay, uh, yeah, a prehistoric slot. I don't know, but it certainly looks like a slot. Okay, so it contains a lot of different parts. Okay, like this one looks like a boulder, and then this one looks like a. <laughs> then we have belt. Okay, like I told you, he certainly looks like a slot with the uh, elongated limbs, and the the face is basically just like a cartoon slot. I remember having this beach towel, this large beach towel with a belt on it. Okay, um, yeah, it was a big, uh, big beach towel. I think it was given to me by Fun Page since I've been working there for the longest time, and uh, it was given to me by the editor of uh, Fun Page. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and then we have this picture of uh, one of the main protagonists from the movie The Crude and then all of these uh, other prehistoric branches that you have to build up in order to build up a tower okay so that is pretty awesome okay now let's start building <laughs> okay uh, first we have to build this uh, catapult like uh, toy so we simply put this uh, this uh, yeah, this thing, <laughs> this prehistoric thing over here to create a catapult. Okay, I think uh, that might not be correct. Okay, hold on a second. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I think uh, that's, uh, yeah. So this is how you do it. Okay. <laughs> and I think you have to position belt here. And then you simply tap on the other end to actually make a uh, belt the slot, the prehistoric slot, fly up in the air. So we'll use this as a catapult to actually topple down the tower on the other end. Okay, so once again, ooh, <laughs> wait, <laughs> oh no, okay, so that's it. Now we have all these uh, to create our tower. I think uh, since we don't have any uh, solid uh, platform, it will be very, very utterly difficult. So you can do all sorts of uh, different uh, strategies to, uh, for you to actually make up uh, a tower using all of these. Okay, you can probably do something like this, and then do something like this. Then do something like this if you're really bold enough. I think they have a really sturdy... Uh, yeah, they 
yeah, you can basically do that. <laughs> I do it. Uh, it's not a well balanced uh, uh, surface, but if you have a flat surface, a table that is sturdy, I think you can actually build up a tower. And once you're able to build a tower, you use the catapult to actually topple it down. So you would have uh, two opponents for this particular game. So one will be building the tower and then the other one will try to topple down the tower that was built and then vice versa. So you can each have your turn and the one who is actually able to topple the tower with just one shot, uh, that would prove to be uh, <laughs> the, re the winner for, that, for this particular game. Uh, I mean, uh, yeah, with just one shot, we're able to topple down the tower. And that would be pretty awesome. So it depends on how many uh, tries, uh, how many times that you're going to use the catapult to actually topple down the opponent's uh, tower. Uh, that would be the measure uh, to. That would be the measure or the mechanics that will be used uh, for the game. <laughs> okay, so that is it. It's a very simple, simple toy, but it packs a lot of. Um, fun and uh, yeah enjoyment uh, and I guess all those who will be playing with this game will definitely enjoy uh, playing with belt and of course uh, this this picture of uh, okay I'm not very familiar with it anyway I think this is one of the human beings earlier a crow magnon uh, human beings uh, one of the main protagonists in the film Cruise okay now, since this is now officially a part of my Percy's Basket toy collection, I am searching for my, <laughs> my pencil pen. Okay, uh, in order for me to sign this uh, particular toy, just to make it official that this is now a part of my Percy's Basket toy collection. And there you go! <laughs> this is Belt. Okay, now I must say, this is just an amazing grace. So once again guys, uh, let's try to be thankful to God for all the amazing grace that come to our lives between the form of a belt toy and this, this guy, okay, I think he, this is his master. Anyway, uh, they're from the movie The Crudes, uh, by produced by DreamWorks way back in 2013 and these toys were given away by McDonald's Happy Meal here in the Philippines. <laughs> Such a wonderful toy and a great addition to my Percy's Passport toy collection. Or basically guys, let's be thankful to God for all the amazing grace, be they small or big, be they seemingly insignificant, or the truly eventful ones, or just about every amazing grace that make our lives a lot more happy and jolly. And I thank you guys for always tuning in to Percy's Passport Toy Story. <laughs> Thank you to the new subscribers. Thank you so much. You don't know how happy you made me. Uh, yeah, by subscribing. <laughs> and please uh, invite your other friends. If you enjoyed this particular uh, yeah episode of Persons Fast with Toy Story, please invite your other friends, your best friends, your BFF, your siblings, your older sisters and brothers, your aunts and uncles, your moms and dads, your grandmas and grandmas. How do you brush your teeth <laughs> after asking them? Um, how they brush their teeth. <laughs> you can also ask them to uh, to to uh, to subscribe also to Percy's Fast Food Toys because we still have a lot more Percy's Fast Food Toy stories up my sleeve. Okay, so until the next one, bye bye for now, and I hope to see you again with our next Percy's Fast Food Toy story. So until then, bye. <laughs>